gosh and welcome back to my channel and I hope you guys are having a great and wonderful day and if you're new hello and welcome and hope you guys like my videos stay hit the subscribe button the post notification icon so it notifies you every time I upload a new video so for today's video we're vlogging I just decided on this maybe 20 minutes ago it's Friday we have another school day you guys want to see more days in my life more college videos more college days in my life so I'm here to show you a very realistic version and by that I mean it is 12 I woke up this morning at exactly and precisely 10.59. If you guys have seen my videos before, you know what time I have class? 11 o'clock. I finished my class, took a shower, washed my hair, and now I'm going to style my hair and do my makeup. So let's go ahead and go to the bathroom. So like I told you guys, today I am vlogging. I'm just showing you what my day is like, very realistic, given that I just told you that it's 12 o'clock. I could have played along and told you it was 8 a.m. and made you uh, feel like I'm more productive than you are currently having, but yeah, that's not the thing. <laughs> I'm a STEM major, struggling and not sleeping very well. Uh, last night, I went to bed at 3 a.m. and that was a result of me waking up at 10.59, precisely one minute before class. The night before, I went to bed at 10 p.m., the first time in weeks. First time in weeks, but we did that and then the next day we still woke up at 12. Wait, how, where, where was I going? I'm gonna wash my hands to then wash my face. You know how I feel about me washing my hands, wash my face, you know the drill gonna do that so it's Friday but it's not like regular Fridays like if I was on campus I would have already texted my good good friends and it would have been like what kind of mood is this weekend are we gonna party are we gonna stay in and eat pizza like what is it and then depending on that we would already had slash be making plans for tonight but but <laughs> as soon as since we are in online situations it means that it's Friday meaning that what movie am I gonna watch tonight that I didn't watch yesterday, that I didn't watch the day before, that I didn't watch last weekend? Or I'm gonna be like, what homework do I need to catch up on that I should be doing tonight, but I'm gonna put off till tomorrow. So, because it's online Friday instead of regular Friday, I usually use my Fridays to like cook something that I really wanna eat, or just like find a new recipe that I wanna try. I love to bake and try new recipes, so that's usually what you'll find me doing on my types of Friday nights. However, today is a busy day at school, as are every Friday for me. My Monday, Wednesday, Friday schedule, which is the same schedule those days, are my busy days where I have the most classes, which is what I'm gonna be doing today. Because everything that I'm doing for my classes I can do on my own time. That's why I'm getting ready this morning and start whenever I'm done getting ready. I always have a goal for myself for my either Monday, Wednesday, or Friday classes to finish before five, six the latest. So I don't go crazy and I have like a good separation between school and life, even though everything happens in the same room <laughs> because we're online students, you know, even though we'll be sitting in that same bed um, later, like there's no separation of the two. I still like to strive to finish by a certain time so then I can actually have a Friday to party. So we're gonna quickly finish my hair, do my makeup, and then we'll get started with our day. I finished my maquillage, my makeup. I also did my hair. And it's drying. And this is today's fit. Get into it. Very comfortable. It is an upgrade from what I usually wear. <laughs> if I wasn't filming, I'd probably have the audacity. Like I was saying, if I wasn't filming, I'd probably just have a hoodie, even if it's hot, even if it's cold. I was like wearing a hoodie. But for today, I brought the shirt. I brought the shorts. I brought out the look. So in the beginning of my day, I try, I try, I'm emphasizing trying uh, to do my bed and get my room kind of like tidy. So when I work in here and when I do my schoolwork, clear space, clear head, at least I try, I try, right? So I'm going to make my bed just for you, just for you, cause we're kind of set habits, good habits. Um, and then clean up the room just a little bit. I 
finished up tidying my room a little bit. It is nice and clear. Now I'm gonna go eat breakfast. Not breakfast, it's brunch. It's like 12.30 now. We're gonna make brunch or like my favorite lunch to make, the easiest thing I like to make, uh, which is salmon rice and some sort of vegetable um, because it's quick and easy and delicious. So we're gonna go ahead, chef it up, cook it up, and have some good, good food. Let's go. Wait, but before we do that, let me show you my outfit real quick. I know I already did, but let me show you a mirror, a mirror version of this outfit. Okay, so this shirt is from Target. I just like how big and nice and neutral it is. The shorts are from the Nike men's section because they're more comfortable and I like it and I love them and I got them, so I wear them. And then shoes, the jandals, get into it. The premium shoe option that I have been wearing since I got to college and I brought it back here and I'm gonna bring it back again when I go back to college. So this is the fit of the day. Okay, we're now in the kitchen. We're gonna make lunch for today. Like I said, I'm making salmon, broccoli, and rice. We already have some rice, so I'm just gonna make the broccoli and salmon. I'm just gonna show you real quick in case you're interested. So I use pre-peeled garlic. We got some olive oil, salt, pepper, and then these little broccoli florets from Costco, which are always great. Started with my broccoli, put it in, olive oil, eight minutes, let it brown, and then we'll do the next step. But for now, we're gonna start with our salmon. I like to divide my salmon and put it in little plastic bags. I did this every time I was in college, just to have like pre-divided portions so I could just go ahead and make my meal. So got my salmon, I'm gonna take it out. I keep it simple, salt and pepper. Usually I could add like paprika and other things like that, but today I decide not to do so. And then I'm gonna put it in the air fryer forever how long that tells me to do, cause it doesn't make a mess and it cooks it very nice and it leaves it juicy. So we're gonna take out the salmon and do that fast. Sprinkle the salt. Salt, pepper, flip it, salt, pepper. Fish is seasoned, put it to the side while the other things cook because it takes longer for the other things to cook. And then right when the broccoli is about to be done, I put the fish in. We're gonna eat this up, then we're gonna do our homework and our schoolwork. The most important part of this video, the entire reason I'm doing this video. But lunch is more important for now. <sighs> lunch was great, lunch was fantastic, it really was. So I'm back in my room and now I have to do my assignments for today and I have to hand them all in before 11.59 tonight. So for today, I have to do my religion homework, I have to hand in my physics homework problems, I have to take a quiz for my molecular biology class, and then I have to do a video recording for my French class, and I think that's all we have for today. Let me double check. So that's everything that we have to do for today. I like to do the easiest stuff first to get them done with, the things that take less time. So for today, that would be my religion homework and my video recording for my French class. And then things that take more time are like my physics problem sets and my quiz for my molecular biology class. I like to leave that to the end. So then when I finish off my day, I finished off with a bang. Like I, I feel accomplished because I did something hard. You know what I mean? Never mind. Turns out that my religion homework today is a lecture that we have to watch, <laughs> a 15 minute lecture. So we're gonna get cozy and we're gonna watch it. finished watching my religion lecture I didn't even know that it was gonna be that long for this chunk of the day I thought I was gonna do the homework real quick boom boom bam move on to the next thing I don't know if I showed you my board today or if you've seen my board in my previous videos this is my to-do board I just kind of write down everything that I need to do for the day where's my eraser so religion homework has been completed can be erased and then we'll move on to French recording and French homework as the next assignment. So let's do that one. I've 
finish my French homework. This is literally the best part. I just do this not only to remember what I need to do and be able to be on top of my work, but I get to erase it. Sign me up. Next recording. Literally my favorite thing to see on my canvas when it says submit it. Submit it. We just submitted it. So it is currently 321. Here's the thing. I am used to, or I have accustomed myself to taking a nap every time I finish eating. So after I eat, I take a nap. Cause my brain in my, after I eat, it's just like, I need to take a nap. I need to take a break. I need to take a snooze. However, I did not do that today. And I'm currently doing my physics homework and I'm literally so tired. So here's my game plan. Are you guys, are you guys good? My game plan is, I'm gonna finish this physics homework. I'm on question 29. I only have two more to go. And then I'm gonna take a nap. Now that's a really bad idea. You know what I should do? What I should do is finish my physics homework, then do my molecular biology reading, take my quiz, and then I have nothing else to do for the rest of the day. And then after I nap, that sounds like a productive. See, see we have to think out loud and be productive and think about our choices because a nap right now would be fan freaking tastic. It would. I think I'm gonna keep working. And then I'll take my nap. Yeah, that's, that's how I'm doing. Okay, so we are about to start our last assignment slash last class of the day, molecular biology. It's currently 4.03, which means I have 57 minutes until my end goal time. I always try to end between five and six o'clock. This will take me maybe like an hour, an hour and a half. I have to do the reading and then have to take the quiz. It's like a reading quiz, the reading plus quiz. So today I need to read 10 pages and I don't only read it, but I take notes. So, so this is my molecular biology notebook. I have talked about this notebook many times. I'll link it down below. My favorite notebook, awesome, fantastic. So these are my notes. Uh, let me just flip through them if I can. I feel like I'm telling you a story and then we learn more. So I read and then I take my notes so I can retain as much information because it is a reading quiz and you need to answer the right questions. So that is why I take my notes. If not, I would have just like read it and moved on. So that is what I'm doing. So I'm gonna give myself maybe like an hour, an hour and a half to do this because the reading is quite dense. You have to understand what you're doing and understanding the processes so you then can write it down in your quiz. So it's currently 4.05, I'm gonna say 5.30. 3520. I'll check in. I'm on page 274. I have to finish 274, then 275, and then 276. And then I'm done. However, no, and then I have to take my quiz, and then I'm done. However, my back hurts. My booty hurts from sitting here for so long. I put on my glasses because these past few days, my eyes have been really hurting because I've been on the computer all day and then I'm on my phone when I'm on my free time and then I watch TV on my free time. <laughs> I'm causing my own trouble, right? Um, but I decided to try them on again because I don't think it doesn't hurt to try. However, this leads to a dance break. That's where I was getting to. We're gonna dance a little bit. I'm not gonna include the music that I'm currently listening to in my room right now in the video because copyright claim. We already did that a couple videos back. So if you wanna see that, go ahead. That video, I didn't even monetize. So we're gonna do a little dance break, a little shake it off, a little rejuvenate. So then I could come back and finish off strong because my body hurts and I need to shake it off. Because I'm not gonna be playing the music so you can hear because <laughs> copyright, I thought I was like, you might as well put on my headphones, play the song shake it out and then i'll play whatever song on top of this so you guys can dance just pretend you're listening to good spanish music ready
dance break is over. Let's finish off school. And just as predicted, I finish on time. It is 5.34 and today's school day is finally complete. I am done. I finished all my assignments. But right now, what I wanna do is close off this video, relax the rest of the night, watch some movies, watch some TikToks, maybe make some cookies. I've been craving chocolate chip cookies, so I might do that tonight. So that is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below on any video you guys want to see next. Don't forget to follow me on my Instagram at natasha.mather. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel. My camera cut me off, but I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Ooh.